Since quarantine hail. What's up, civilians? These are my thoughts on the on the coronavirus. You know, I'm parked in the middle of my city right now. Uh, it's a, it's a coronavirus outbreak, and uh, everybody's infected. I'm in I'm in a hazmat 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 suit, um, with with a respirator tank, you know, attached, you know, because I cannot I cannot go for my usual newspaper uh, th uh, thing that I uh, collect in the morning without my suit because it's a quarantine hell right now there's people there's people blah, 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 all over all over the place and uh, it's not it's not a good sight uh, they're foaming out the mouth as a rolling black <laughs> rolling black and back um, and this is a message from your president, Presidente, for people in Spanish show. Now the Democrats are politicizing the coronavirus. You know? How the fuck are we politicizing, publicizing, publicizing the coronavirus when you just signed $51 million goddamn pill? $51 million goddamn dollars you had there. For all the poor families that you didn't give up. But now, you say we're politicizing the coronavirus, so what the hell is this then? What's this guy doing then? Pumping, uh, uh, um, booty gas for the town to smell like booty? I mean, get your mind together, Trump. You out of your fucking mindo. For the people in Spanish, mindo is mind in the English show. But let's let him finish. All the people boo. They're politicizing it. We did one of the great jobs, you say, House President Trump doing. They go, oh, not good, not good. They have no clue. They don't have any clue. They can't even count their votes in Iowa. They can't even count. It's 19,357, just to be precise, dickhead. And this is their new hoax. But, you know, we did something that's been pretty amazing. A new hoax? Are you got uh, what? Huh? What? No. Why is it a hoax? And then you signing fifty one billion dollars. I'm fucking completely mind for goddamn OPP. I'm legally blind. Hold me down, mama. I'm. I wasn't driving. We're fucked. Now I'm in my hazmat suit, in the middle of the city, in my truck right now, five in the moon, connecting my. Collecting and connecting my newspaper clippings on the wall, connecting all the dots, seeing where everything gonna land. Because I don't know, I don't know what it, what what's gonna happen now. Everybody buying extra toilet paper now. I can't even shit now. I'm gonna die of a shit and disease. Cause uh, cause uh, y'all buying extra toilet paper. You know what I'm talking about. Now we're extra fucked. Now my food contaminated too because. Everybody just have a symptom of, of sneezing and I chew, I chew, I chew, I chew all the god all over the goddamn place, man. Motherfucking sneezing everywhere, rubbing in and shit. Fuck you. Fuck you, die slow, motherfucker. I'm in my hazmat suit. Fuck you. And then look, all, all the people in the airports. Like, let's travel more because we're infected more. It's a thing. It's a thing where people like to go out more. I, I seriously haven't seen it this busy in my city in a long time. I mean, how the fuck? If there's a goddamn outbreak of motherfucking killing disease, why do y'all want to motherfucking crawl outside? Stay in your goddamn house. Wash your hands. Don't need to touch, no need to touch the goddamn the door and get all that paper and sneeze. You motherfuckers sneezing and touching everything. I see you. You motherfuckers, you. I chew. I chew to you too. Stay healthy while traveling. Avoid travel if you have a fever. Avoid travel if you have, look, even this says it. Avoid travel if you have fever or cough. So why the fuck is everybody... Like, even Tom Hanks has it now. It's it's because of traveling. Stay the fuck inside! 
Stay inside. I mean, that's what it is. It's because we're fucking going outside. Look, spread of coronavirus. Map reveals spread of killer bug. 2,762 deaths and over 81,000. 81, 81, and all the case of the global. And you know what's like even more bothering? Look, all these places. But what's even more bothering is that people, it's like, it's like the flu. It's like the flu. I don't know why it's a panic. Everybody's panicking. I don't even know why. It's just like the flu. How the fuck do you know? How the fuck do you know it's like the fucking flu? Do you fucking ever see it before in a telescope? I mean microscope. Have you? Have you ever seen it before? So how the... Fuck, do you know? That's what I'm saying. How the fuck? That's what I hate when people think that they know and they don't know a goddamn thing, man. Protect others from getting sick. <laughs> Sorry, I forgot. I, uh, you, you, sorry, I'm getting corona. Choking all that shit, man. No, I had a little bit of gas. But um, I have to read what's on the screen. Coronavirus symptoms. Or something else. Flu or coronavirus. Fever, fatigue. Fuck it. I don't get it. Fine. This is a whole bunch of shit. Look. What does coronavirus make you do? Make you fall flat on your face. Obviously. Guys, we fucking seen it. We seen it. Motherfuckers were walking and falling on their goddamn face. And there's gonna... Look, mark my words. Mark my words. There's gonna be a goddamn movie on that on Netflix. So... Very goddamn soon. They're gonna make movies about this shit soon. Yes, I know, dickheads. There was fucking movies before about it. I'm talking about soon. After it happened. Fucko. <laughs> after it happened. You know, um. And then what else? Like the $51, $51 billion. We're not gonna see that. Vaccines? Why would vaccines be expensive? I don't understand. You see, I don't... This shit is supposed to be free. Who's controlling the money in our government? Seriously. This is fucking... This is bullshit. I'm starting to think that this is fucking bullshit. I mean, think about that. $51 billion. And this is before he's getting elected. What the fuck is going on? He's talking about we're pub how are we publicizing it or uh, politicizing it when you're fucking doing uh, oh my god he just like he makes everything to seem like it's a joke this guy the the president I mean for real if you listen to him for a while. And now I'm in my hazmat suit in the middle of the city because I'm a fucking veteran for yet. And I have all I have all the equipment, you know what I'm saying? I got bazookas to blow any motherfucker up that will get close. And um and I got a car with spikes all around it to run all you motherfuckers over, whoever the wanna get close. <laughs> no, um, Look at this fucking douche over here, buying all the fucking toilet, all that, all that paper. How the fuck? Why would you? And then for all the families that need it, what then? I mean, not only are they taking toilet paper and and, and tissue, they're taking all the food. People are taking all the fucking food. So if people are sneezing everywhere. And smearing it everywhere. And you're going to buy your fucking food. You're going to touch it and get sick. Look, I, I see him shopping. Look at the way he's shopping, right? What do you see in his hands? No gloves. So you're buying all of this shit. For the coronavirus. But you have no gloves on. And then you leave your legs ex exposed. So when you, you know this shit lives on things for like three days. Yes, 
It lives on 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 like certain materials for longer periods of time. I think it was copper. It was like a day or something. Look, but the the it stays airborne for hours. Somebody could sneeze in the air. You walk three hours later in the same spot and you get it. You're fucked. This one over here. She's like, oh, I'm an artist. This is an artist photo. No, you just literally, they want, they were doing the same thing. You would have bought a whole bunch of shit too. Look, what are those? Like gloves? Those are cleaning gloves. I don't know, man. I just, I don't know. I don't know what to think anymore. And look, and if, why would you, I wouldn't even buy no food from there. Or I guess you will have to wash it really good. I mean, oh my God, it's a fucking hell. Where did this shit start? Wuhong? And fucking, how, how, what, what the fuck, how? It must be all the fucking crazy, dirty shit. And you guys know I'm, what I'm talking about. All the, <clears throat> all, all that bacteria in the streets and they got all those food mixed with other foods and rats and dogs and oh my God, man. Like that shit is crazy. It's crazy to me that. Look, we're, we repeat, there is no cause for alarm here in the USA. That's what they keep, they kept saying, right? They kept saying that it wasn't a fucking, that's nothing. There's no reason to panic. And then the very next day, SOS, pandemic, global alert, uh, run for your fucking life, dodge your heads, watch your ass, the coronavirus is fucking. No, I mean, like, for real, they're really, the coronavirus, they make it seem as if it's coming, knocking on your door, just like this. And it's going to infect you. It's it's scary shit. Because now what if... they Look, my, my daughter's not going to school anymore. They just closed down the school for like... Uh, what was it? For like two weeks? They said a week, but... We got another message that it was for two weeks. But what if it... Oh my God, like... What if a whole bunch of other kids still got infected? What if, like, you know, just because of playing around with the media? Oh, it's fake news. This is Donald Trump. It's fake news. It's not real news. You see, that's what the Democrats are using to publicize. Look, just just hear him talk. No, for real. We're 15 people in this massive country. And because of the fact that we went early, we went early. We could have had a lot more than that. We will do everything in our power to keep the infection and those carrying the infection from entering our country. We have no choice. Whether it He said, from entering our country, we have no choice. <sighs> you stupid motherfucker. Don't you see that people are, <laughs> people are infected with it out of the country and they have to come back in. There's nothing you can do. You have to let them back in, fucko. So they're coming back with the virus, whether you want them to to know it or not, because they're not going to tell you if they have it or not. And they're bringing it. And these fucking retards are coughing and sneezing it um, and smearing it all over the fucking place. Whether you fucking want to or not, Mr. President, fuck head. So stop, stop saying that it's like a political move. This is all... F- you know, he's trying to fucking win. And that guy, Joe Biden? Are you fucking kidding me? The guy's a walking fucking dumb tart. <laughs> Sorry about that. I'm, I, I might be getting some symptoms of the corona due to fucking Trump saying that it was fucking... No. Listen. And f- First of all, I don't listen to fucking Trump. And you guys shouldn't either. You should not listen to the fucking news about this shit at all you should do your own research i mean listen to just watch it but don't believe everything that they're saying just do your own research see if it's true or not i mean i'm showing you the fucking facts people say it's like oh the flu has killed sixty thousand people look i have the chart right here it, it kills sixty thousand people and and the coronavirus only has killed 13 look no it's not fucking 13 you dumb bitch 
Look at the number. 3,690. It's almost 4,000. How much is for the flu? But read. I said, estimated 61,000 Americans died from the flu 2000, from 17 to 18. From 2017 to 2018. The coronavirus, look, in, 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 in that amount of time, in one year, and look, in, that's in three months. We gained 4, 000, almost 4,000 4, deaths in, 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 in three months. In fucking three months, man. In three fucking months, man. Imagine in a whole year, just like the flu, we're going to have the same fucking numbers, man. You know what I'm saying, yeah? Look, and look at this goddamn dusty McFucking melon head at the fucking right. And the and, and look, and on the left, you know, he's been like caught using uh photo altering like colors. Is he that orange? He's not under the sun. Cause look at the back of his head, it's like white and the you could man, all this crust behind my ears. Uh anyways. Look, look at, I mean, the guy looks like burnt toast. It's a fucking hoax. We're all hoaxed. <laughs>